Starting off today, with the LASCOC2 filter, showing the last flare, from the 17th and the latest flares on the 18th. The solar flare you just witnessed, looks to be a halo solar flare. Now a look at the flares, through the ink filter. Using this difference filter, the halo solar flare can be observed much better. This is the SOHO satellite, which has the LASCO filters, it orbits in a circular motion between the Earth, and the Sun. This satellite is 0.01 astronomical units from the Earth, which is about 930,000 miles from Earth. LASCOC 3 filter from this satellite, captured the flares from the 17th, and the possible halo flare, from the 18th, today. Up next, is two CME models from today. This first one appears to show the flare from the 17th, the flare's direction is away from Earth, and gives the OSIRIS, REX satellite a glancing blow of radiation. Here is the second CME model, from today. Showing the direction of the latest flares going in different directions, the suspected halo flare crosses the SO-10, Parker SP and Stereo A, satellites paths. Earth's magnetic field, also known as the geomagnetic field, is the magnetic field that extends from the Earth's interior out into space, where it interacts with the solar wind, a stream of charged particles emanating from the Sun. This is the model of the geomagnetosphere pressure, for today the 18th, notice it is at the highest end, of the spectrum gauge. I was lucky to be able to record this model. It kept going back to the 16th, where the pressure was very low. Glitch or something being hidden. Here is a different model showing the magnetosphere pressure. Notice the pressure, is at the top of the gauge chart. Seen on this flare classification chart, is 4 C-class solar flares, which occurred in pairs so, close they look as though they are one flare. Using this KP chart, it shows on the 17th, a KP, measured at 5 which on the G scale forecast a minor geomagnetic storm for that day. This is the position of the planets today. And as always, sit back, relax, and let me keep my eye on the sun for you.